Again, today is the first alert weather day and a reminder that we are entering storm season. And if you need a storm shelter in the metro areas of Jefferson County, we're on your side with where to go. That's right. County Emergency Management says you have several options to choose from. If you're living in the metro area, James Giles is live in Birmingham tonight. After speaking with the EMA, James is a shelter in place guidance. The same for people in the metro area as it would be for folks who live in rural areas. Well, Brittany, Steve, Jefferson County Emergency Management Je Deputy Director Chris Tate says whether you're in a high rise or a mobile home, the guidance never changes. You want to make sure you're getting to the most interior part of your home, getting as low as you can and staying away from all the windows. If necessary, you can even shelter in your bathtub, cover yourself with a mattress and a helmet and ride the storm out from there. You can also head to the Jefferson County EMA's website and find storm shelter locations near you. There are several locations in Birmingham metro area, including ones in Smithfield, Pratt City Park, and Jimmy Hudson Park. Tate says there's nothing that indicates storms impact rural areas harder than metro areas, and everyone should be prepared no matter where you are. And others um, have had uh, those direct impacts uh, to larger scale metro type buildings. Um, and uh, we've been very, very close uh, here in Birmingham, uh, too close. Uh, we all remember what we saw in, in 2011. Um, it was, you know, literally just on on the background of our of our city. And Tate is referencing the 2011 tornadoes in April that killed 240 people in less than an 18-hour time frame and moved more than 1,200 miles. Now he also says you want to download apps that help keep you in the know, like the First Alert Weather app or even the Everbridge app that several municipality municipalities around our area use to keep their citizens informed. Reporting live in Jefferson County, James Giles, WBRC Fox 6 News, on your side.